of Dublin Fire Brigade and the National Ambulance Service. But this did come up earlier at our uh, corporate policy group meeting. Um, and I agree it's unfortunate that it goes through the media before it comes here. Uh, but I did ask a question of the manager and I got no answer. And basically, I'm going to repeat it here for the sake of the public and the other councillors, that what the manager is recommending in terms of uh, aligning the two services, the Dublin Fire Brigade and the National Ambulance Service, is that the delivery of that service will be carried out by the National Ambulance Service, which is run by the notorious HSE. And the notorious HSE is on record as having a very, very poor record in the delivery of the National Ambulance Service as against the delivery of the ambulance service in Dublin by Dublin Fire Brigade, which has been excellent and has a world-renowned record of, of, of safety and delivery. And why that choice was made baffles me, and I think that, answer, that question needs to be answered. Why choose, if you want to streamline the services and have one delivery, why not give it to Dublin Fire Brigade rather than the HSE? The only logical answer is saving money. And if saving money means that we're putting people's lives at risk, then this is a wrong decision, a seriously wrong decision. And according to the evidence so far, the delivery of the ambulance service by the HSE has put people's lives at risk, and we don't want to see that happen in our city.